And hello from the Midlands of England, the venue for this match is Villa Park. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary position is Lee Dixon. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Aston Villa up against Leeds United. All right, Derek, thank you. Well, both managers will be reminding their players how important it is to start off the game really quickly. Really attack the opposition, put them on the back foot, see what comes of that. Hopefully we get a good game. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man. Lee, what are you anticipating seeing from him? Well, a hat-trick in his last game. Defenders beware. Concentrate on your job. They will take great pleasure in stopping the goal machine. Great. Here's how the lineup looks for Aston Villa. We're thinking 4 3 3. Yeah, one central striker, Derek. The width comes from the wingers who will stay high and wide. A very narrow midfield and a conventional back four. And a look at the Leeds United starting 11. Thank you, Villa Park. Fairly conventional 4 5 1 setup. Yeah, that back four will be protected throughout the game with the five midfield players in front of them really important that they do support that lone striker when they do have the ball and so the match is underway McGinn Consa it's with Douglas Luiz John McGinn, now with Ross Barkley. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. The cross is on. John McGinn. Real danger. Can he take advantage? Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Patrick Bamford. Mateusz Klich. Patient enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? Still possibilities. Well, no damage done. Douglas Luiz. Now with Ross Barkley, Matt Target. Well, the fans know they were lucky not to be behind there. They can't keep conceding chances like that. Grealish. Esri Consa. It's with Douglas Luiz. John McGinn. Plenty of forward momentum here. But can they produce? McGinn. Esri Consa. They really look after the ball when they have it. Matty Cash. Trezeguet. McGinn. Ollie Watkins. It's with Douglas Luiz. Intercepting it intelligently. Alert defending. Chance to cross. Douglas Luiz. It's with Trezeguet. It's with Douglas Luiz. dangerous plays it back and it goes the goal for 1-0 and that changes the dynamic
And here it is again. It's a great team passing move to set up the chance. And it's a miss hit, to be honest. But they all count. I think he'll be laughing to himself when he sees this on the telly tonight. Opening goal of the game, then. Goal for Aston Villa, number 20, Ross Barkley. Pablo Hernandez. And a throw in, it's going to be. Matt Target. Douglas Luiz. John McGinn. It's with Douglas Luiz. Poor pass. Breaking at pace. And showing fine vision. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, you're right, he has played well and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch in this form. Sit back and enjoy him in the second half. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Pablo Hernandez. It is to be a throw in. Grealish. Ollie Watkins. And players waiting in the centre. And the referee has awarded a corner following that touch. Over it comes. I must admit, I thought he was going to score with that header. Yeah, it was a quality cross, and he gets up well, and it's just wide. Elder Costa on the offensive. It looks promising. And Bamford. It might be on for them. Watkins. Watkins. Trezeguet. McGinn. Ollie Watkins. It's with Douglas Luiz. Beautifully timed. Bodies forward and the break looks on. All hands on deck. Calvin Phillips. And Bamford. An attack for promise. And he might be through here. Still a chance. 
Terrific block there. Well, he's given us away. Couldn't keep it. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. Tyrone Mings. Watkins. It's with Douglas Luiz. Very comfortable when in possession. Ollie Watkins. Well, nothing productive, really. Pablo Hernandez. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. They might be able to get in now. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Barkley. Jack Grealish. And space for the cross. Barkley. This could be it. And it is. He's done it. Surely a case of game over. We can see, Derek, from this better angle, it's all about the technique. When you're volleying a ball, it's all about timing. Let it get to the right place for your foot to make the connection. And there you go, in the back of the net. Well, enjoy the good days as a coach. It can be a roller coaster ride, I can tell you that. So, 2 0 now. Inside the final five minutes now. Phillips. It's with Douglas Luis. McGinn. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Wide of the target, and he's going to be disappointed. Disappointed. Wow, it's a shocker. He should be doing a lot, lot better than that. Well, we are going to have a decent amount of stoppage time. Three minutes to be exact. Stuart Dallas. And now it's Phillips. And there goes the whistle for full time. The Villa fans will leave the stadium happy on the back of this victory lead. Yeah, their two-goal advantage in the end was just reward for their good play today for me. Worthy winners. Well, his performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Lee. Well, he played well, scored a goal. What a good performance from him.